The purpose of uh, the research project is to explore the relationship between a human uh, and a human-like character in immersive virtual environments. And I do this by combining methods from arts and sciences. My, my project particularly emphasizes meanings embedded in the human situatedness, uh, the meaningfulness of the context in which this encounter with artificial humans takes place. If you think to what extent stories penetrate the human society, not only entertainment, but also education, politics, uh, this starts to make sense, right? I think the most complex artificial characters that visually resemble humans uh, are found in video games and films. Um, it's remarkable how human-like these characters have, have become in their appearance. The algorithmically automated behaviors have been designed uh, by people. However, they look like humans and smile like humans. Uh, to what extent these characters can adapt to the individual player's personality and situatedness in the game story world, for example, or uh, the story outside of the game world, that, that's relatively limited. There are um, fields of application for the findings that uh, we have in everyday life. Uh, um, I see my work linked to specific uh, field of social robotics, um, constructing uh, artificial human agents intended to serve or assist humans in all types of uh, social context. There is a demand for this, one can say. Consider loneliness, uh, for instance. In Europe, loneliness is described as one of the uh, most fatal uh, human conditions that may lead to severe illness uh, and even to death. The question is, could, could such an adaptive human-like character provide some help for people living in such conditions? Uh, yes, uh, because we know from psychological studies that a friendly human face, uh, just a smiling person in photograph, almost automatically affects the human mind in a positive manner. So imagine having a similar and intelligent, entertaining friend who is familiar with your life, your habits, the names for your children, your hobbies, tea you like to drink, uh, and uh, in addition to all that, can talk about them. The no comes from the hard challenge of making such characters uh, relevant from the point of view of the context of the, of the lonely person. I'm positive about the outcomes of, of uh, future research and I'm really excited to be part of the Estonian scene in, in uh, studying these uh, artificial characters and their future applications.